It's finally over And what do you say To start all over How can you sleep When this bed's so sober And what will you be Without your lover No matter what you You know, I'm still haunting you And after all we've said and done You're still my only one We were never this broken Never this broken We were never this broken
Well, uh, good evening, everybody, and welcome to South Yorkshire Ghost Hunters at uh, Annesley Hall. And uh, today's uh, Wednesday, and uh, we've uh, come down here tonight to do uh, to do a ghost hunt. So uh, uh, we're outside the uh, the church at uh, Annesley Hall, and uh, we've got uh, some other members here, part of the group. So we'll be uh, joining them uh, very shortly. Just having a walk around here. This is my uh, my first time here at the uh, at the location. Didn't know anything about it really until uh, uh, Stuart and uh, go on uh, Lisa told us about it a few days ago, and. Uh, we thought uh, we'd come and check it out. It looks, uh, it's an amazing place. Looks, uh, looks real nice. And quite a lot of uh, buildings here as well, empty buildings. So, uh, anyway, this is the church. Anyway, everybody else is down there. We're just going to walk here, see what we see what we can find. Anyway, this is a All Saints Church here at Annesley Hall. can see and is an honestly old church timeline so it's like at one stage you tried doing some renovations on the on the building so cool and anyway, we're going to another spot which is the uh, main mansion to the house uh, in a short while 
So uh, we're just up at the uh, up at the church at the moment, trying to uh, what do you call it? Uh, see if we can pick up anything here. These uh, gravestones are uh, very old. No writing on them no more. It's a shame when that happens because the history goes about the person that was here. So, uh, only, yeah. Uh, oh, that one's okay. What with that just then? I just like her uh, now. There's somebody here, can you make a noise? Can you make me a, make a noise to let me know you're here? And sure, I've just well, I did hear something, but I'm not sure if it was a, a spirit. Can you throw something at me? Can you throw throw a pebble or a stone? Let me know that you're here, you want to communicate. Come forward. I'm here, I'm not here to harm you. I'm here as a friend. My name's Martin. I'm here to make contact with you. This is uh, another part of the uh, of the building here. Empty ruins. That's my cigarette that I'm having. Sorry about that. It's, uh, this is huge. This place is absolutely huge. And uh, hopefully I can get down there. But yeah, I heard like a in, in front of me sounds a lot better than than that what I've just done but uh, anyway there's uh, another part of the house over there you can't see it because uh, Lights that we're not for, but uh, you can see down there, and, and over there is supposed to be where the uh, servants' and quarters were. It's huge. So hopefully we can uh, we can get in there and, and take a look in there as well while we're here. I'm going to uh, take a walk back over to uh, everybody that's joined us tonight here <coughs> <coughs> and uh, find out what uh, everybody else is doing. We've only been here about 30 minutes. Uh, this place is uh, is fantastic. Could do with coming around, coming here during the day, having a good walk round during the day.
the right drop down there. Must be at least a hundred foot. Does anybody in those buildings would like to come in? Show me sign that you're here. Could you come and stand at the window? Let me know that you're here. You want to communicate? Could you throw a stone for me? Could could you stand up at the window? Could you show show yourself at the window? I mean you know harm come as, a, come as a friend I'm here to prove your existence I'm here to prove that life goes on after death I don't know if we can get in here a bit later on but uh, hopefully we could have a look anyway Gonna have a have a walk back now to see how everybody else is. But uh, this place is uh, absolutely brilliant. So this is the church here. inside the church Hello. and where we got Stuart and uh, Lisa Diane and Dave evening and myself so uh, Anyway, I'm going to uh, have a short break here and uh, we're going to probably set up and uh, we'll uh, uh, come back uh, in a short while. So, bye-bye uh, for now. Uh, just show everybody where our equipment is. Anyway, we've got some uh, equipment now. We've got uh, a couple of uh, laser grids down we're facing uh, uh, this uh, this wall here uh, I believe it's the uh, bell tower uh, but there's a, a fence on here uh, a gate on here now what is it and uh, that's the way to get into the bell tower there anyway you got REM pods down uh, over here here okay so I'm probably enough now <laughs> if that's the spirit trying to communicate could you light all four lights up on there please can you come and touch it light all four lights up did it light all four up then can you come and touch it it'll give you energy as well if you touch it can you light all four up So show us how good you are as well. Thank you. Thank you so much. If possible, can you open that door for us? Can you push that door open? That'd be even more fantastic if you could do that by pushing the door open. Speak to us through that. You can 
If you're a man of the cloth, a Christian, could you like those lights up for us, all four of them? Are you a vicar? A priest? Krishna? <laughs> Not sure with this Catholic or uh, Church of England, you know. Yeah, should have read it really. Are you Church of England? Are you Catholic? We just described other grounds around here. Maybe Protestant? Put down here, we've also got the SP7, makes it to uh, Bluetooth speed here as well. <laughs> oh, this must have been uh, some kind of uh, for drinking out of. I don't know what you what you're gonna try. Matthew. But did that say Matthew then? Matthew. Is your name called Matthew? It's a good Christian name, Matthew, is that your name? Is your name called Matthew? Wow. Let me just take that up here. Yeah, I'll stand and film like what we you would. Okay. Well, I'll turn this off then. Uh, or you can do table tipping, whatever you want to do. Board. Do you want to speak to us? Can you light all those lights up on the uh, on that device on the ground? What you're touching? Can you light all four up? <coughs> can you spell? Or can you? Or you're doing the? Uh, what do you call it?
If you'd like to take, take this table towards me for say, yes, you like to use that. Take it towards me and say yes. Just confirm that. Thank you. Don't quite screw it off again. Absolutely brilliant. If you can use that energy more, I'm Lisa. We'll use that for yes to Lisa. Could you like that again for me, please? Some parts of me, please. This is towards Lisa. And would you be able to push the table towards Dave then? Who knows? Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. Are you a female spirit? Do you like the company of us being here with you? Do you like us being here? Do you mind us being here? So light for it.
I thought that the female said, female just said only me. Is that actually you? Are you doing that? That's fine. Thank you can you. use them to communicate with us as well. You're doing an absolutely fantastic job. That's all I can choose to do. We call that a REM pod. That's its name. What's it that? A bit, oh, it's, it's a bit strange. It's a bit strange. Are you taking my word, what I always say? Were you listening to us? Were you listening earlier on? You know, telling Lisa that I keep saying the word strange. Was she the one that was uh, touching the balls in the... Uh, over in the, uh, the archway, where the gate is? Is that you?
Very nice. This is our two ways to go. Yeah. <laughs> Me and Lisa are always going to be able to join us. I nearly went for a slip. Oh, yeah, not there. <coughs> Come on, Spirit. She was all this energy. You've got an extra person now to play with. Let's move this table. Tip it up. Walk around us. Tip, tip, tip the uh, table to the person that you are behind. Behind Dave, then. <clears throat> You're behind Dave, then. You're behind Dave. Tell that we're gold. Mm, I know. Yeah, that's because you're <coughs> old and you're nearly dead. Show me the idiot. Nearly dead. <laughs> oh dear. Can you maybe tip it up and get it onto one leg? Start twisting the table. Mm. Well, you've got an extra person now. Tip it mm. right up. Can you do it? Can you get it onto one leg? Okay, can you stop it at that, please? Okay. Can you maybe get it on one to, to one leg? Come on, we don't mean no harm. You're doing an absolutely fantastic job. Come on, can you stop it at that, please? Can, can you push the table towards me and Stuart? Off. Can you do it onto, get it onto one leg if you can? You're doing a fantastic job. Come on. Okay, can you stop it there? That's going to fall out. I'm Yeah, it's on David's leg. Oh, right, okay. Yeah, it's, to, uh, it's, going, it's going to fall over completely. Is that no devil? Mm -hmm. okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Can I ask you what your name is, if you use the device that's making all the noise over there? What's your name? John. With that John? Mm -hmm. Hey, John. Mm -hmm. There's a John. Mm -hmm. What is John? Was that John? Can you flash the REM, the REM pod? Do you remember the REM pod? Yeah. Thank you. Is it going off? Yeah. Huh? Is your name John? Is that what you said? That's what we thought we heard. Teach your own pod. Yeah. Jan. Um, yes. Thank you. So just to confirm that, if we put our hands back on this table again, can you lift this table all the way to Dave, where you said you stood behind, and confirm that your name is Jan? Just so we can be polite, that's all, and respectful to you and speak your name Thank properly. you so much, Thank you, Jan. Jan. My name's Diane. I'm I am good. I'm Stuart. And I'm Lisa. It's lovely to meet you at Bert Jam. There's Martin over there with the camera. Thank you. It's good to meet you. Is Jan a female or is he male? Well, we'll speak to a female, so. Is your name Janet? Is Jan short for Janet? 
touch the ground pot again, or you can put the table towards me for yes, or the table towards Dave for no. Is your name called Janet? Okay, so it's a female then called Janet. Yes. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I thought that just said Jamie, no, Janet. Rempod's going off again. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Janet. Are you English, Janet? Literally, right. I've got my fo I've got the photos I did, and I've got the three minutes. That's, and that's that's what, what whatever that? we had after, we've we, 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 we just keeps on rubbing it towards me. Do you like it? Sure. <laughs> so we don't like you because you're trying to get them locks. But it's just deleted all that video. Can that can you put it onto one leg, please? It's happened can you lift now. it up onto one leg? About three times. Before. Oh, okay, thank you. Thank you so much. Absolutely. Thank you very brilliant. much. Thank you. You're doing an absolutely amazing job there. Can you get it twisty? Oh, that's absolutely brilliant. Thank you. Got me to the cob. Here's your arm. This is, oh, let's see if I can break this one. <laughs> oh, there we go. Are you alright with that? Yeah. Can you do right. that again, Spirit, please? Tilt it towards me first. Come on, Spirit. Thank you. Right, can you spin it onto one leg again, please? Oh, you just want to bang it on me again. Can you move it onto one leg, please? And you did a fantastic job before. You put it onto one leg, you can twist it like, like you did before. I can have some of those, I not I know, move some it, of that Back up a bit and move it onto one leg, leg, please. Look at this, Jenny. Use okay. all our energy. Let's just dig in and I put it on the chair. I think Jan's going to try and get between your legs, mm. uh, Stuart. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> How dare you, Jan. <laughs> it's really forcing down onto my legs at the minute. I really feel the pressure. There's, um, there's a light fluctuation as well, where you know where your coat is. Yeah. A lamp's shining on you, and there's a, there's been a light fluctuation. Jan, you're hurting uh, Stuart's legs. He's got bad legs. Can you take him <coughs> off him a little bit? Thank, Thank you. you. Can you move it onto one leg, please? Is this still Jan? Is it still Jan? Strong, that one, it? Jan strong, wasn't doing this strong. before. Jan, is this still you? If it's you, can you like the REM pod? Please, Jan, if you're still here, is this you manipulating this table? Jan, can you come through, please? Um, you're here. Can you twist it onto one leg, please? Jan. Use all our energy. Thank you. Thank you so much. That was absolutely brilliant. Thank you. Let's try and When I said Jan, the uh, I'm here. It said I'm here. Yeah. yeah. yeah Thank yeah. you so much. Thank you. I think the spirit's here, but the peaceful art being Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. I think someone's ready to uh, come forward. Mm. If there's any spirits hiding in the walls, would you like to come out? Would you like to open that door for us? We're not here to warm you. We're here as friends. Can you maybe use the table or move the table without us actually touching it? Is that you, John? You still here? Keep 
you, can you do that, Jan? Can you uh, open that door? Yeah, I can do that. You might see me to bust. <laughs> yeah, <no. laughs> come on, please. No. <coughs> open that door. Can you push it open? Sure. Wow. Just have a little go if you want. You don't have to. It would be nice if you did. We would appreciate it. You're doing an amazing job of what you've done already. You can get some of your friends, some of, some of the people who are here with you. And you build up your energies to make that door open. Maybe touch some of the other equipment which is on the floor. There's a ball over there, if you touch that or kick it, it will flash. swearing at us? I can't imagine them swearing at us. Not in a place like yeah. this. That could be just a... Uh, what do you yeah. call it? The um, radio thing. Yeah. Are you still around us, Jan? Still with us? Doing absolutely fantastic. I know you're trying, I can feel you trying to move the table again. Are you trying to get to the light? Are you trying to get to the light? One pod's going on. It's very strong, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. One pod's going off. <coughs> Can any like, mods or bugs sit that? Are you trying to follow the light? Slugs. Slugs. <coughs> slugs, yeah. Slugs, can. slugs will crawl on it, but there is none on it. No, there's none on it. Mm, but slugs will crawl but on any it. Any bugs that are flying about can be no. kind of going to. No. no. But a slug's quite heavy and they'll crawl on so it. So there is something definitely there what's actually touching it. Yeah. Is that what you're about the light? Or yes, do you think it's the light <coughs> to, to get to heaven? Is that the ally which is actually reflected? Nope, sorry. Yeah, well. <coughs> what are you looking at? A reflection of the light. I don't know if I can do it with yours. Or it's something like a tiny bit of a torch or something. Oh, I don't know. I'll come back. If I turn this off and then I'll we'll say, then that's definitely not me. Table spirit, stop oh. moving it for us. That is, yeah. Come closer, Jan. Jan, Jan, light them all up. Look at all the red. Good. Are you ready? Good. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, put all your effort into it into that and then come over here and, and have a chat with us. I just heard a, heard a very faint voice say hello. I don't know if that was on the banshee box thing or, behind you. or here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we've got banshee box. Well, whatever the car back then. Yeah, one of them. Yeah, whatever that say gadget is that you've got I don't know if it was on that or whether I just heard it it's extremely faint and it just hello I just heard Michael Jackson was that you who said hello behind Diane Jan is there anyone else behind Jan which said hello it's Michael Jackson trying to make contact with his 
You never know. Well, yeah. you said Michael Jackson. Mm -hmm. Well, there's more than one Michael Jackson, though. There's millions of Michael Jackson. Mm -hmm. Long before Michael Jackson was even born. Mm -hmm. What is it that makes the noise then? Because it was the big box bit with the speaker. Yeah. And it's the square thing that makes it, that does it. Yeah, it's, it's because That's it's standard yeah. concept of the area. Yeah. That's why you get <coughs> all, all that noise. Yeah. 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 Are you still with us now? Can you make uh, the lights flash? Can you move the table? Can you look on this table for me? Sorry, can you, light back can you do that, please? Can you not come underneath it? So we can feel it. Can you walk around us? Touch one of us. Yeah, touch Lisa. Yeah, touch me. Don't mind. Yeah. Pull my hair. Mm -hmm. Are you trying to Are you trying to contact us? Can you move this table again? Can you push this table? What's that way far towards you? Yeah. Are you a male spirit? Are you? Could you move the table to show us where you are stood? Okay. So you stood between me and Dave. Is that correct? You stood behind me and Dave. Come on, point where you stood again. Move the table to where you stood. Okay. Can you uh, come into the centre and make all those hands go cold? Okay, can you do that? Can you come and touch his hands? Try and make his hands go cold? Or can you knock on the table? Come on, touch his hands. Make us all in the circle go really cold if you can. If you're with us, make it go icy cold. I can't really see his breath at the minute. 
says you can't read it. Not that bad. That one. Make it go icy cold around in the middle of the circle, please. Take it onto one leg. Tip it towards Martin. Make the table spin. Make it twist. Tip it towards Stuart and Martin now that I'll get it onto one leg. Or you can tip it towards Dave. Okay, lift it onto one leg. <coughs> lift it any direction you want onto one leg. Shows how good you are by lifting it onto one leg. Can you do that? One leg, please. Come on, try one leg. Try one leg. Come on, twist it. No. I don't think we're going to get much here, do you? We've got quite a bit. No, I mean much by uh, same spirit. Mm. Don't move to a different area. Say again. Don't move to a different area. Yeah, if you want to. I don't know. What do you mean, in grounds? Yeah. yeah, if you want to. Yeah, Martin. Have a... Yeah. Uh, so what we're going to do, we're going to, uh, what do you call it, uh, pack up here and we're going to move to a different location within the grounds. Uh, like I said, we're in the church at the moment. I, I, I feel that it's quite peaceful here and uh, uh, very, very, very peaceful. We, we have got a spirit coming through by the name of Jan, which is a female spirit, but uh, I think she's uh, <coughs> like a soft delicate spirit and uh, I, I think that uh, the spirits here are more of uh, uh, a stepping back they're not, they're not coming actually close to us uh, apart from apart from Jan and uh, I do believe that they're watching us uh, but uh, not making uh, that contact that we want with them there's another board here let me just check this board here. <coughs> so, uh, there we go. But, uh, beautiful location, and uh, uh, I uh, will be coming back here again. It's a, it's a wonderful place. But we're not finished yet. We're going to be, uh, I'm going to go and. Uh, we're going to collect all the stuff and uh, we're going to go off to uh, another part of uh, the grounds here. So bye bye for now, we'll see you soon.
Well, uh, good evening, uh, everybody. Uh, and, uh, welcome to uh, South Yorkshire Ghost Hunters. Out tonight on location in Annesley Hall, over in uh, Nottinghamshire. So uh, this is where we are this evening. So uh, if you don't mind, please, uh, uh, if you would uh, like to uh, share this video and uh, try and get a few more people on here. So we've been here a couple hours uh, up to now, uh, down at this uh, down at this place, and uh, we moved to a different part of uh, uh, of the uh, of the building and uh, having a walk around, seeing what we could uh, can see here. Anyway, there's a few of us down here tonight. And uh, we're going to see uh, what we can get. Hi, Dean. Hi, Bell. Who else have we got on here with us? We've got Dawn. So, if you could uh, share this uh, this video with your friends. Uh, <coughs> the uh, first part of the video will be the uh, second part well it, no it to be the first part actually because uh, we was at uh, up at the church uh, not far from here that was the uh, whole church and uh, uh, so uh, So what I'm trying to get into now, that's the uh, the main building over there. Oh, you can't see it. Oh, oh there you can. The uh, light's not too brilliant, but this is the mansion here, where we at. That's where some of the other team members are this evening. Oops. Anyway. Okay, I'm going to go back this way. <laughs> so uh, what I'm doing, I'm just going to uh, take a walk around here. And uh, look at uh, potential places that uh, we can go to and set up some equipment. And... Uh, so we can get some uh, activity. Yeah, we're doing okay, Hub. Uh, not doing too bad. So we, uh, we're out live tonight. <laughs> nice. Uh, pond here in the middle of the grounds and this is where the uh, the servants headquarters was at the uh, where we are where we're looking at right now so you, you can't get into uh, into this side because they're all being boarded up and we're not uh, gonna pull any off if there's any that uh, we can just walk in then we will do that but we won't uh, break in and enter to get in here So, uh, so we went to the church, we got a, a little bit of activity, mainly from a spirit called Jan, who came through to us and, and spoke. But uh, uh, we didn't really get much more. It was very peaceful up there, up at the church, where we was. So 
to the side of the building now. I wouldn't like to, I would, I'd love to think, well, would Lord would love to know how many rooms there is in this building. There must be hundreds. Oh, it's a big place, Don. It's huge. This is the uh, the servants' headquarters, uh, as I as I believe. And we're going to follow the uh, the path down here. We we'll take a look up there. See what's here at the end, and then the okay. All right, this looks quite interesting. This might be some somewhere to come and set up uh, some equipment. I wonder if this uh, could have been used as a, a burial place. It looks like it. It looks like it could have done. I'm not too sure. What what's your thoughts on it? Could coffins have been laid in here? It looks like it uh, with the uh, with the looks of things. Okay, could this be like a not sure what that could have been at one time. There's a beer bottle down there. Apart from the uh, local, uh, probably the local drunks in here, from time to time. Okay. Okay, that's an old outside, but I heard a, a tap before that. That was me. Is there anybody here would like to communicate with us? Would you like to show me a sign that you're here? Now I'm not sure if that was water dripping or a, a tap. I'm not too sure. I don't think there's any water getting in here. Oh. It could be actually, there is a plastic buckle there and it's a bit wet on there, it's with the moss and that, so there's a possibility that uh, rain could have, uh, well, water droplets could have just fell on that. So I'm, I'm going to debunk that as, as being water droplets, but I'm going to ask out anyway. Is there any spirits here who would like to communicate with us? Would you like to show me a sign that you're here? Can you make a noise inside this building? I'm not sure what it was for. It was quite interesting. I'm wondering, was this... Okay. Another tap there. I think it's water. It could have been a wash house, I'm not too sure. It's like Meckle then. Yeah, this just water droplets. Okay. That's oh. strange. And there's like a little uh, holes in the wall here. There's one at that side and then there's one at this side as well, so I'm not sure what they're there before. Anyway, let me uh, go for a walk on the top there here and uh, see what we can find up here up these steps. Ok, 
okay let's have a walk down here I should have brought the SB7 with me and tried that Well, these doors are over, all boarded up. Ah, you can see inside here. Oh, well, there's a bit of a drop down there. The floor's missing, as you can see. What's that hissing noise? Can you hear that hissing noise? So that's where the chimney pot was. The uh, that's all the chimney brush. Oh, you can see the fire there. Uh, you can see there. You can see the fire. I would say a cat. I probably would say like a, a might be an owl or something in there. Uh, I'm not too sure but there was a hissing noise I'm not sure if you heard it when I had my uh, camera in there don't think we can can we get up here Oh yeah we can, there's some steps here, not sure where it's going to take us. Okay. Be careful where I walk here. Okay, there's a fence there at the bottom, so we're not going to get into that side. It's a shame I'm not going to get in there. It's right at the bottom there, you, if you can see there is there is a fence. And I can't see any other way round to get to that. So uh, anyway, I've had a look. We'll uh, have a steady walk back to uh, everybody else. But uh, it's quite uh, interesting. So it don't look like there's any more buildings down there. That's my breath. There's nothing paranormal with regards to that. So I'm gonna gonna come back shortly and uh, I'm gonna uh, go into that room which is below us here and uh, to try and do an investigation in, 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 in there to see what if I can pick anything up 
with uh, using the REM pods. And uh, also, uh, I'm going to try doing a uh, SP uh, using the SP7 as well. Like I said, I wonder how many rooms there, there is actually is in this in well in the, in this building alone. Uh, there must be uh, a couple hundred buildings. Hi, Sharon. I don't remember coming up this bit very now. Watch it well flat. Oh, it looks like uh, so it's trying getting in that way inside the building. Let me know. Get the nails in here. But. Uh, Somebody's put in. And this place is, uh, oh, it, oh, it's, it's massive. This place, it's absolutely huge. And now I, I wish that uh, there was a door open. So I could go in and have a look, but uh, we're not going to do that because uh, if we uh, take something off for century, it's classed as uh, burglary. Now, if the door is open uh, and you walk into it, it is then classed as trespass. And it comes under an act of parliament so it's not classed as uh, as burglary but if you if you take a few fourth century into the building then it's classed as uh, as burglary and you could be charged for burglary and uh, and sent to prison but if you uh, trespass it's mainly uh, a slap on the wrist sort of thing so anyway yeah uh, we've got plenty uh, of things to uh, to do outside here anyway and uh, have a look round the, there is that pond here again that'd be nice in my garden that some nice koi carp in here anyway yeah uh, there's a door gate there there's a signpost up here oh no the in so you can't get through that way there's a wire there Hi Richard Nice thick chain there So this I'm back to where I was before But I couldn't walk up here Because uh, the ground's not very, uh, very safe
There's, uh, anyway, we've got uh, we've got David. Evening. We've got uh, Diane. Hi. We've got Lisa. And also Stuart as well. Have you ever been in that room around that corner? It's really it's warm, garden that room. garden room. Is it a garden room? Yeah. There's really like troughs. Yeah, it's like, it's like, I thought it were like, you know, keeping, uh, uh, <coughs> keeping what they call it in dead bodies. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, what they call it, uh, I've just been in there, stood in there. Had five, had five minutes. I might probably go back down in a short while. And uh, I'm not too sure. I can see bats flying around. <coughs> yeah, some bats flying around. Lovely. Do you find the lake? I found the pond. Did you? Yeah. It's empty though. Uh, it's really <laughs> <coughs> Hi, uh, Laura. What else have we got? Okay, but yeah, you can't. There's uh, you can, oh, back there, get that huge, a uh, big bat there. I'm not sure if we saw it. I'm just gonna have a walk around this side <coughs> and then oh, yeah, watch the manhole, Martin. Have you ever heard any talking while you've been here? No, apart from your four. We've got the laser grid on because we were trying to see if anybody would walk in front of it. Because I just heard a, a voice. Did you? Yeah. Now they Okay, I'm just going to have a walk around this side. And uh, see what. Uh, There's a manhole down here. Oh, it's here. There's a, there's a bit of a, a bit of a drop of a manhole. Oops, nearly fell down it. Sewage down there. Now, if this is the uh, the main house. Oh yeah, that's uh, the way that we just come in. It's been raining uh, quite a bit up here today and by the time it came out I thought the ground would have been dry but it's not Can't really go any uh, any further, apart from uh, looking at this bit here. It uh, looks a very uh, spooky place. It's a shame we uh, can't uh, get inside it. No 
Okay, I've only got 15% left on this uh, on this uh, phone. So uh, I'll have to uh, most likely finish the uh, the other half of the video on uh, on camera. And then, uh, but you'll be able to watch it again on uh, on YouTube later on when I uh, when I upload it onto YouTube. Anyway, if you are interested in the paranormal and you live uh, near uh, Doncaster, if you live in uh, near Mexborough, uh, we are uh, looking for new members and uh, we're based at the uh, Athletic Club in Mexborough. You can hear a pod going off, they must be setting up some equipment. So uh, you're more than welcome to come over, check us out. Uh, we do charge an admission fee this helps us towards us uh higher of the building and uh, also uh, helps us with our our insurance and also helps us to buy some equipment for the group <laughs> so if uh if you're inter if you're interested come and come and see us every tuesday from 7:30. We'll be out again live, hopefully on uh, on Friday. Uh, not sure where we're going yet. Uh, well, we did have uh, an idea of uh, of the places that we was going, but it all depends on the weather. So anyway, I'm going to uh, say goodbye to you for now, and uh, the uh, next lot of video will be done from my camera, as uh, I've left my uh, my phone at home. And uh, what I call it, uh, Diane's phone's on 15%, so uh, I'm gonna have to do the rest uh, from from camera. So you'll be able to watch it all on uh, on YouTube and uh, do a, a live party <coughs> as well. And uh, the bats here are, are ginormous, the, the huge, they're flying around my head right now. And the camera's gone uh, a bit uh, out of focus. So uh, we'll say goodbye, and uh, we'll uh, well hopefully uh, well you'll be able to watch the rest of the video on uh, uh, on YouTube. Bye bye for now. So by this device, you can touch one of the. Uh the REM pods. Am I blind? <coughs> am I blinding you both? No, no. What was that noise? Did you hear that noise? Yeah. yeah. Is, it, is anybody out there calling us? There's a light there. Hey? Yeah, Battery's going for it. <coughs> Might be police. Police? Yeah. Oh, police come on, yeah. Well, it sounds like idiots. <coughs> hey? It sounds like idiots, doesn't it? Well, it can't be them who got you that time. No, <coughs> any idiot. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs>
Can't you that? No, it took me long enough to get here. I said I thought I'd pass by. <laughs> <laughs> what time to get here? What to eat? Oh, that's yeah. the bat. Yeah, that's the bat there in front yeah. of us. Is anybody here wishing to communicate with us? Can you touch these balls on the ground? Do you want to take one on to try these days? Oh, the blueberry green tea. Ah, fairly one. Oh, Ramsky. <coughs> I'll be the to I'll bring the 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 what would you say this would have been? I'd have said these were stables. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking with, uh, with, with, with clock there. Especially for those things, yeah, that probably would have been for the, you know, coach to get in. Yeah, yeah, it's like you say, staff clothes and stuff. Initial <coughs> <coughs> It's a what? A very popular place for people to actually call in. <coughs> I'm glad to, I'm glad we're not in that church anymore. And you open the door, we've absolutely shut ourselves. Uh -huh. <laughs> you open the door, Jal. Uh, yeah. yeah. I'll be like, I'll be like, <laughs> See what it is, see what it is. I've had that done to me once. I uh, was at house in Barnsley. <coughs> uh, my old paranormal group that I used to be in. We were called to this house because she was having some bother. And we found out it was her dad that had uh, resided there. And uh, we sat in the boy's bedroom and I asked, could you open the door? And it, and it opened up. Quite like that. Never had it done since. Not do I know it anyway. That one, that garden, yeah, yeah, I went in it. it would be a lot warmer than where it was, yeah, outside. yeah, yeah. But I think it's because it's, it's got soil on top of it, yeah, absolutely. It was brilliant, weren't it? The other week, yeah. Cause it was really, really cold when we came, and uh, went in like five degrees warmer than where it was outside. Well, if there's somebody here, can you come and say hello to her? Uh, <coughs> can you come and say hello? We've got some devices on the ground, some machines. Can you come and touch him? There's somebody in there. Where? Uh, there, yes, there's some. Oh no, it's outside, isn't it? Taking pictures. Can you come and say hello to us? Can you use these machines on the ground? And come and speak to us?
Yeah, that's uh, going, just going up that, ah. going up from East Midlands, probably. Anyway, yeah, we're back, and uh, we're uh, going to do uh, a Ouija board session here, see if we can get anybody that uh, used to live here, uh, in the building, or somebody worked here, and then uh, we'll see what comes through. While I'm eating Oreos. Is there Do we have any, any spirits here like to come and talk to us? Okay, thank you. Are you a male spirit? No, okay. So you must be female, yeah? Okay. Can you tell us your name? Can you tell us your name, please? A B A R O Abron Abron No Abron A B R O N Is your name called Abron? Okay, never heard of that name before. Are you foreign? No, it's probably. What? Can you tell me what year you died? Can you see the numbers? What year did you die? One, seven, two, six. So you passed away in 1726. Is that correct? That's why I probably won't understand the uh, understand the name. Uh, in uh, in them days, they would have uh, had uh, different names. Well, nice to meet you, Abron. My name's Martin. I'm Dave. And we've also got Dave here as well. Okay. Uh, did you used to live in this house? In oh, okay. Was you a servant here? Yeah. So did you live in the house across from where we are now, where the other people are walking down? Yeah, okay. Thank you. Did you, li did you live here and work here for long? Okay. How many years did you work here? Five. You worked here for you worked here for five years. Okay. Did you enjoy working here? Okay. Did the owners uh, look after you while you was here? Okay. Did they pay you a good salary? Did you uh, get uh, paid uh, good money for working here? Yeah, okay. Did you work here? Oh, no, you didn't. You only worked here for five years. Did you die here? Uh, did I ask you that question earlier on? Did Did you die here? No. Okay. So, do you, do you like returning back here? Yeah. Do you stop here all the time now? No. Okay. Did you see us coming here? Okay. 
Yeah. So where do you originally live? Where did you originally live after when you left here after five years? Where did you move to? What port of the country? Which part of the country did you move to? C. E. D. E. Why are you walking? <coughs> C A D E A mm -hmm. Cadia Cadia What part of the country was that in? N O R T Are you trying to say Northern? Okay. Northern, uh, the Northern part of, of the UK. So was you up towards, uh, uh, was you on the coastline? No. Okay, was you in Central up north? Yes. Is, is this area in Scotland? No, okay. Is it up in Cumbria? Way up, up that way? Yeah. Yeah. Yes, okay. There is some, uh, there's some other people here. Uh, so we're hearing noises. Uh, so they've been here about 45 minutes, these other people. So, Cadia, up in, uh, up, up towards Cumbria, that's that sort of area. Uh, so okay, uh, fine. Did you have any children? Uh, okay, how many children did you have? Three. Okay, thank you. Did uh, did your children live with you as well? No. Okay. Could you uh, look after your children? Yep, okay. Did your children live here in this house? No, okay. Did you, so you had children after you uh, left this place, yeah? Yeah, okay. Did you, ever, did you ever marry? No, you didn't marry. Okay. Can you hear that again? Mm. Yeah, inside of us. I'm not sure what it is. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> I'm not sure what uh, what else, what else I could. Do. Did your husband stop with you all your life? Uh, you. I can't. No. A. Why? D. I know what it's trying to spell. Was your husband murdered? Okay, thank you. Who who murdered your husband? B. Z. B Z C. Okay, I'm not sure what that means, BZC. Do you know who, who murdered him? No. <coughs> Did your husband work here as well? No. Okay. So your your husband was was murdered. Whereabouts? What? Where was he murdered? In what town? Which town was he murdered in? C E J I 
You. Okay, never heard of that. Are you? Can you spell? No. So your 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 spelling is not very uh, not very good. Okay. What job did you? If you can try and spell it out for us, what job was it that you did here when you worked at this house? What job was it? D. I. Y. Yeah, why? E. X. Did you do manual labour? Yeah, okay. So, uh, did you uh, have to do, uh, like, cleaning? Changing the uh, the bedrooms, uh, making the beds, that sort of thing. Did you uh, have to uh, wash the clothes? Yeah. Do you know wh where we are here right now? Uh, as I am looking at this uh, big door that's uh, in front of me with a with a clock above my head. Could you tell me what this door was for? Yes. T A B O E Okay. Was this stables? Stable door. Yeah. So there was there were stables inside there. Did you work here as well? Yeah? Okay. So did you have to do different all different just types of jobs when you worked here okay so you didn't wasn't committed to just one job while you worked here no do you know how much you got paid okay how much was was you paid free eight Thirty-eight. Thirty-eight what? G. U. I. N. Did you get paid in guineas? Okay, so we got G U I. What's the next letter? G U I L, Gwil. Gwills. Never heard of it. Gwills. Was that a form of money? No. Was that for your hook keep here? For your keep here? Yeah. Okay. So you worked and you was given food and a bed. Yeah. Okay. Was you like... Uh, what's the... Uh, was you like, uh, what do you call it? Uh, a, could, did you come from workhouses? I don't know when, I can't remember when workhouses first started. I don't know it was eighteen hundred, but this was seventeen something. So I'm not sure if they if they would have had workhouses in them days. I'm, I'm not too sure. <laughs> How old was you when you came to work here? You can see the numbers. Three. Seven. So you was was you thirty seven years old when you worked here? Yeah, okay.
What did you do before you worked here? T A Y L O Oh, you was a tailor. So you used to make clothes? Okay. Did you enjoy that? Did you make good money from that? No. Okay. Sorry to hear about that. Have you ever been anywhere to another country at all? No. Okay. So you was a tailor. Okay. Did you make dresses? No. S uh, suits? Jackets and things like that? No? Okay. Uh, tell me your name and can you spell me your name out again? I forgot what it says. B G H B G H. I don't know what that means. B J H. When you worked here, what kind of meals did you get? What did you eat? F C I Do you know do you know what the food was called? What you ate? Can you do you know how to spell it? Okay, try again for me please. F was E E a and e l what was it e a m yeah. e a m what's the next letter if there's one e a okay i'm not sure what what no, that. No, did you <laughs> Did you get good food? Okay. Did you eat things like chicken? Yeah. Yes and no. Did you get le the leftovers of the chicken? Yeah. Okay. And Q. So you got you? Did you get like leftovers of the wings and things like that? No. Okay. The bones. Yeah. Well, you you must have not lived uh, a good life here then, if you just got the leftovers of bones. The leftovers of the bones. Did you? Uh, was that made into a soup? Yeah. Okay. Like a like a chicken soup. I've done that many times before when I've cooked chicken, you know, I've uh, made uh, ch chicken soup from the chicken bones. It's uh, quite nice. So did you, is that what you ate a lot was soups? Okay. Well, that can't have been good, Dave, eh? I'm good now. Did you have bread with it? Did you eat a lot? Did you have to eat a lot of soup just to keep going? <sighs> yeah. You cold? I'm fucking golden. I'm at, feel my hand. I'm absolutely boiling. Do you want to stop then and warm your hands up? <laughs> Let's go say goodbye then. Anyway, we're going to say goodbye to you, okay? 
and we're going to say thank you for coming to talk to us. Okay, thank you. Bye bye. Bye bye. What's the matter? I've twisted me. Yes. I'm going to leave it to Stuart. He's like next to boxes and bags and things. It's just twisted round, hasn't it? Yeah. You put it wrong way, <coughs> twisted it in the <coughs> That way. Anyway, we uh, yeah. we finished for the night and we're heading off home. So uh, we're all going to say good uh, good night to you. Night. 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 Morning. Afternoon. Night. And uh, night from me as well. <coughs> we're going to head up. I bet you are. Put it back up. Back to the cars. I bet that's going to be. And go home. And yeah, my light's going in my camera. <coughs> You need to get some thermal vests, Dave. Oh, I need to get some thermals. That's what I've got on. Thermal vests. Nice. Keep you warm. You. Some, uh, <clears throat> some thermal gloves. A nice thermal hat for the winter, Dave. Ah, uh, I call it gas fire that's had it. And uh, what do you call it? Uh, I'll, uh, I'll try and carry it. Are you sure? If somebody could just lift that leg up. Watch your fingers. <laughs> so, <laughs> just check that we're not left out. Nope. nope. It's like, we're yeah. all done. We've got the first snarling gun. Yeah. Anyway, if you uh, heard the video earlier on, I said I heard some like hissing. Uh, Diane did a recording, and uh, what I call it, uh, it sounds like somebody snoring. And I played the video back from the uh, live video. Let me know, Dave. Well, I did on Facebook, and it. Uh, it does actually sound like somebody is actually snoring. So, uh, and the room that we was in was like the bedroom sort of thing. When I put the uh, the camera through the window, so it does sound like somebody. It's not. I thought it wanted to be in a hiss from a from a howl or something like that. But if you do listen, if you do listen to it. If somebody's uh, in a deep sleep and snoring, so uh, quite interesting. Now we're going into the woods here. Oops. Careful coming up here. So I ain't got much uh, light left on uh, my camera. I should have took some. Some. Just trying to think which is the way. So I'm going to say goodbye, and uh, thanks for watching, and uh, we'll see you later.